Hey everybody, it's Jen back and I am here with a layout that came from my stash actually. I did it between uh, a couple of my kits and this layout is a photo of my nephew and I that was taken in February and I got the idea of this layout from Jen Scow who she did that whole um, six by six paper pad love series that oh I fell in love with it just like everybody else um, I have so many six by six paper pads and I don't know how to not that I don't know how to use them I don't use them so she had made this layout where she had cut strips of the six by six paper pads and lay line them up vertically across like down the page and I love that I love the idea of the strips I um, wanted to kind of it a little bit out of the box so I ended up doing them diagonally uh, diagonally like staggered down the course of the page and this is the actually the second layout I've done like this the first layout I actually used uh, I did the exact same thing with a different color pattern and used it for a, a photo that was older and did it for um, one of the challenges I think for the hip kit was the National Scrap Scrapbook Day challenge one of those so I loved it so much that I ended up scrap lifting myself um, so I ended up using three I think three different six by six pad uh, pieces of paper here and just cut them to all different widths and ended up um, just kind of staggering them across the page here uh, it, so that it's kind of looks like you're going down the stairs going from left to right so that's what I'm doing here and um, so, like I said, this is a layout from my stash. So everything, um, there was not a, I didn't use a kit. It was all either leftovers from different kits or uh, stuff that I've bought myself. And I find that I don't, not that I don't use my stash all that much. I do. I do a lot of layouts for my stash, but I don't necessarily always do videos from my, from the stuff from my stash. Uh, but I do have a, I have a decent sized stash, that's for sure. Um, but I'm trying to use it up as much, not as much as I can, because I like having a stash. I'm not one of those people who likes to have it, uh, have absolutely nothing but a kit. I have a whole scrapbook room that I enjoy, so I like having it full of uh, things to play with at my fingertips as I want to. So I'm someone who really enjoys having a stash. So this was a lot of fun, and I this was a uh, scrap piece of paper that it ended up matting the photo on. And I don't know if I said it in the beginning, this is a photo of my nephew and myself from February. I think I might have said that. But anyway, I'm gonna pop it up on some, the like the Scotch mounting tape. And I'm gonna pop that up here on the, on the layout. And then I'm gonna start my embellishing. And my video cuts out here just a second or two, right about here. Um, just I need to change my card there so um, the audio actually might be a little bit off on this video I'm sorry I am still playing with a program that uh, I know Hannah Lemieux had told me to or had suggested that I uh, use a separate program to do my voiceover because my iPhoto kept crashing so I did I, I downloaded just a recorder it's called easy auto audio recorder it's an app for from the app store or from the Apple store and um, it works great so I'm just trying it, it's hard because it's hard to start the like playing the iMovie so and the audio at the same time so it's not I always have to line it up and it's kind of hard anyway I am pulling all kinds of stuff here to embellish I have a Heidi swap chipboard that I'm putting down I did the title with leftover uh, phrase stickers from the Maggie Holmes I think it was the open book line and it the title is you and me and I used a whole bunch of heart or two a whole bunch two different hearts and then I also am using a freckled fawn um, wood frame that says much love and a couple of these Heidi Swap they're extremely glittery uh, teal hearts and I am embellishing here from the bottom, the top left to the bottom right, just like I did, uh, I put the paper. So it's all, all the embellishments are kind of going to go along that line. And then I used up this pack of embellishments that were 
uh, cameras like acetate cameras on pop dots and that those were from Michaels from a long time ago they've been in my stash forever so I used those up and a cut like I said these Heidi swap uh, embellishments where I've had in my stash forever as well so I kind of like pulling stuff and using them using them up but um, yeah so these oh and these little stars are from a studio calico kit I pretty I think I finish them up too. Yep, another package used up and I had fun trying to figure out how, you know, how many things could I use up on this layout and I did pretty good. I finished up two, I think, and a half packs of different embellishments. So that's awesome. Um, but yeah, so I, this will probably be going up when I'm already in Florida. It's Friday night and I, it's like, I don't know, 6.30 and it's beautiful out. The sun is shining. I've got the windows open and I am perfectly fine to do several different, several lay, uh, layovers. <laughs> yeah, voiceovers for different layouts. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm probably going to get, try to do two or three of them in a row and then I will upload these videos so I can, um, then I'll upload them private and then that way I can upload them public over the course of the time while I'm away. Um, it's not, I won't have a let, you know, a video every two days or so, but if I have three, four of them to put up over the course of two weeks, that's better than nothing. So, um, yeah, so that's what I figured. I'm feeling pretty good about doing voiceovers and I'm not too tired. So we're, we're good. It wasn't too bad of a week at work. Um, so this will, I'm just putting a couple of sequins down and after the sequins are down, I, my layout will be done. I will, um, that will finish it up. And now my iMovie is freezing a little bit, so I don't even know where I am with the audio and visual. So I'm going to end that here. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you soon. Take care. Bye.